Hello, my name is Tanja Rudolph from the Heart and Diabetes Center um, in Germany, Bad Oeynhausen. Uh, welcome to PCR London Valves um, 2022. I would like to speak about the unmet need in severe aortic regurgitation. And um, I would like to raise the question, are we ready for TAVI? The prevalence of valvular heart disease is increasing with advanced age, as you are all aware of. Um, unfortunately, in many patients, it's underdiagnosed, and this is in particular true for, for aortic regurgitation. One reason for this might be that patients with aortic regurgitation develop symptoms late. And on the other hand, the diagnosis of aortic regurgitation via transthoracic echocardiography is a little bit more demanding for cardiologists. Severe aortic regurgitation. Um, is accompanied by worse prognosis for our patients. And this is uh, true for all the patients and not only for patients with reduced ejection fraction. Even when we treat patients with um, surgical aortic valve replacement, their mortality at one year is 9%. If patients are left untreated, their mortality at one year is 24%. Interestingly, about 25% of the patients are only undergoing surgical aortic valve replacement. All the other patients are left untreated. The reason for that might be advanced age or high surgical risk. So the question was, are we ready for TAVR in aortic? So far, we had really clear limitations in treating patients with pure aortic regurgitation with the current TAVI devices. The reason for this is that in aortic regurgitations, we do not have calcification of the aortic valve. So it's difficult to fix the currently available devices in these patients. The problem in treating patients with aortic regurgitation with the regular TAVI devices is a really low device success, being only about 84%. In a lot of cases, in almost 10%, a second valve is actually required. And very differently to treating patients with aortic stenosis with TAVR, 30-day mortality is rather high with 11%. And also many patients keep a relevant aortic regurgitations with, when treating them with regular TAVR devices. The Jena Valve Trilogy TAVI system is the first device which got CE marked for aortic regurgitation. The Trilogy TAVI system features unique design due to locators that align the transcatheter heart valve with the native cusps, and this ensures First, an anatomically correct alignment. And second, these locators are able to clip onto the native leaflets, therefore enabling an anchory of the transcatheter heart valve in pure aortic patients with non-calcified valves. We have already the data available of the first 58 patients with severe pure aortic regurgitation who were treated with the Jena Valve Trilogy system. In these patients, the technical success was 100%. In hospital mortality was 0%. 90% of the patients had none or only trace paravalvular regurgitation at the end of the procedure. So overall, the Jena Valve Trilogy system seems to be an excellent treatment option for patients with severe aortic regurgitation who cannot undergo surgical aortic valve replacement. Thank you so much for your attention.